Yo boys, what is going on? Dreamhack is back with even more prizes and more tournaments that you can win. So as you can see, if you go to your compete tab, you will see all of these tournaments. And in this video, I will tell you every single thing you need to know about these tournaments, including how you can unlock them and register for them, what the platforms are, what the prize pools are, the format, and so much more. Alright, so make sure to stick all the way to the end to know every single thing you need to know. And also, I will give you some tips on how to do well in this tournament. But if you appreciate this content, please smash that like button. It helps me out so, so much. And also, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already with notifications on. But after you've done all of that, let's jump in this video. Alright, so if you haven't registered for this tournament, these tournaments should be locked for you. So let's go over how to unlock them. Okay, so if you go to Dreamhack FN on Twitter, or I will have a link in the description, you can click on this link right here, and it will bring you to this registration page. Now, don't click on it yet because it will probably kick you out of the video. So make sure to watch all the way and then at the end, you can click. But some of you guys may be scared to click on it. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. It's the official Dreamhack page. It's on their official Twitter. Like, there's nothing to be scared about. So basically, all you do is just fill out this information. Your email, your name, your date of birth, blah, blah. It is kind of specific. I don't know why they do this, but trust me, they will not steal your information. Alright, so once you've done that, it's gonna bring you to this page right here and you can select what region you want to play in. And yes, you can select more than one, you can select all of them even. So I'm gonna select NA East and NA West, because why not? But if you want to, you can select all of them or just one. And yes, these are the only regions, there is no Brazil or Oceania or Middle East or Asia, so these are the only three regions unfortunately. But if you are in Middle East, you still can't play in EU servers if you really want to. But yeah, up next, it asks you for your Discord name, which you can find right here. If you go to your Discord, then click the bottom left right here, and it's gonna say click to copy username. Boom, you do that, and you just copy and paste that in DreamHack. Then Twitter, you don't have to do this, but you know, I might as well, boys. I'm gonna plug my Twitter real quick. So go ahead and follow me on Twitter, boys. It's AutoClickYT. Thank you all so much. And then right here, it asks you if you want to be a part of a DreamHack movie, now I'm not quite sure what that is, but I'm gonna click yes, because it would be pretty sick if they put me in a DreamHack movie or I guess a video. Again, don't know what that is. You can click no if you want to. And then finally, it says that I understand that I'll have to sign up with a link that will be provided in a second. So you just click yes, and then you get this link right here. So you have to click or copy the link, it really doesn't matter, but I'm just gonna click on it. And then it brings you to this page. And we all know this page, right? That's where we register for all of our tournaments. So then you go back and then you say yes and submit. And then of course it gives you the link again. So you click on that link and boom, we have this page where we can register now. So all we do is just sign in with our Epic account and click register. Now this is an official Epic Games website. So again, this is all legit guys, like don't worry about it. Cause I know some of you guys in my previous DreamHack tournament were worried about this, but again, this is DreamHack official. So now, once we go back into our game, what we can do is either restart it or we can just click select game mode and of course click play and then go back to your compete tab and it should be unlocked. Now obviously these will be locked because you have to qualify to semifinals and finals and let's go over how to do that. So there's gonna be two heats which you can qualify to semifinals and they're both basically the same. So let's go over them. All right, so of course it says that you have to register and then the top 750 players will advance to stage 2. So you have to be top 750 to move on to the semifinals. And then once you're in the semifinals, you have to be top 100 to move on to the finals. And I will go over the prize pools in a second, but really quick, let's go over the formats. Okay, so if we go back to this page right here, we can see the scoring. Oh, and by the way, if you didn't know, yes, this is solos. But yeah, for each elimination, you get 5 points, which is a lot actually. And then from top 50 all the way until top 4, you get 1 point each. And then from top 3, you get 2 points. If you get top 2, you get 4 points. And then if you win the game, you get 7 points. So once again, let's do some quick math and let's add this up. Alright, so according to my calculations, you get 60 points just from placement if you win the whole game and get no kills, of course. And as I said, each elimination is 5 points. So you would have to get 12 kills in order to match the placement. So now you may ask, should I play for endgame or should I double key? Well, my answer for almost every tournament is to play for placement and play smart. Alright, because if you double key, 
let's say you get four kills all right that's 20 points great good job but now you have no mats because you spent all of them fighting in mid game fights and also you have no heals anymore so now with this situation there's no way you can get good placement in end game so again i do recommend playing for end game but if you see a super free kill, like if you hit him 150 or something crazy like that, well then you can go ahead and push him and hopefully you can kill him super quick. But if not, it's always okay to disengage guys, like the importance of disengaging is so underestimated. It is okay to leave a fight. But about the platforms now, it is all platforms and yes, it is cross platform. So that means that PC players can go against mobile players or switch players or anyone else, alright? So it is cross platform. So I know it is kind of unfair for mobile or switch or console to go against PC players, but hey, you can still try, man. And now let's go over the prizes. So in the heats, you don't get anything. You just need to get top 750 in order to move on to semifinals. And even if you make it to the semifinals, you still will not get any money, unfortunately. But once you get top 100 in this, well, then you move on to finals, of course. And this is where the money comes in. So if you make it to finals, you're guaranteed to get money. Because as I said, top 100 players will move on to finals. And if we go to the finals pricing, we we'll scroll down and see that top 100 players get money. So if you make it to the finals, you're guaranteed to get at least $200. And then of course from there it just goes up and up and top 19 gets a thousand dollars already and then top 11 over two thousand dollars and it just gets crazier and crazier and top one gets ten thousand dollars like that is absolutely insane and that is for na east europe is even more okay and one last thing let's go over to the dreamhack page and let's see all of the information here so they mentioned that these tournaments will go on all the way until january 2021 and every month they're gonna have two hundred and fifty thousand dollars that players can win that is absolutely insane so you already know i will cover all of these tournaments every single month so make sure to subscribe boys but yeah sign up this is solos of course and you have to be 13 or older to participate then if we scroll down we can see the point system and of course the tournament dates so it's gonna be 10 games and three hours and then during the grand finals there will be six games which will start every 40 minutes. So if you die, you do have to wait until new game starts. You cannot just queue up instantly. And now this is a breakdown of how this works. So there's two heats, 750 players from each heat move on, AKA 1,500 players move on to stage two. And then you need to be top 100 to move on to stage three. And then this is a schedule for you guys. So you can stop the video or take a screenshot. And yeah, these are the times. And now down here, they have a quick Q and A which basically answers all of the questions that you might need. So of course you have to be 13 plus, it is online, yes it is solos, yes you can sign up for both heats, yes you can participate in multiple regions, you have to sign up, blah blah blah, this will be broadcasted, Epic Games will track your games, this is on any platform, this tournament is for any league players, so if you're in open league or you're in champion league, you can still play it doesn't matter if this is your first time you can still play if you want to cast this tournament you can contact this right here and then the way you claim your prize is you email these people right here and boom shakalaka and then lastly these are the prize pools so if we go to this page right here we can see the prize pools for all regions okay so of course they do differ because there's different amount of players in each region so eu has the most players so it's gonna be the most amount of money and then na wise unfortunately has the least amount of players so it's only four thousand if you get first place but yeah once again you can take a screenshot of this if you want to but yeah boys that's basically all of the information you need to know if you have any more questions after this now i don't know how you would have any more questions but if you do well leave them in the comments down below i will definitely answer them so if you appreciate this content please leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already but that's gonna be it for this video thank you all so much for watching peace out